is Bowman's best uh, dual box divisional. This is from a fresh case, and so we're going to take the two boxes that are up in the top and uh, crack those. But we got Trevor. What's up, dude? I believe we met today. Uh, Josh B, Scotty P, and Bill A in the house. Bobby Witt Jr. on eBay. From what product, Scott? We're going 11 times for this dual box divisional. Again, lots of uh, hit potential here. Should be eight autos, right? Isn't there two autos per mini? Is that right? Josh B down to Trevor. 21 ball. Ooh, nice. And then we're going 11 times for your divvies. That is AL Central, AL East, AL West, NL Central, NL East, NL West. And then we'll match them up. Again, if you guys want to trade an entire division or even if you want to trade a specific team for team, then again, let's see what's there. What? It's not, so it's not auto, obviously, Scott, correct? Otherwise, I feel like it would have significantly more bids. But that's pretty uh, low, dude. All right, Josh B, you have the NL Central and the AL East. Uh, Scott, you have the AL West. So, is Trout sign of Bones best? I think he did. Did he not? Uh, William Allen, you have the NL East. Trevor, you have the AL Central and the NL West. And so, again, if you guys want to make any deals or tradesies, now is the time. We'll shrink that little thing up. Otherwise, we'll do a little printing. If you want to make a trade for a team. Do, oh, that's what I was going to say, dude. Um, his stuff's been flying. I'm sitting on... There's a few dudes that I'm still sitting on that we have uh, from Leaf Flash and Pro Debut and stuff. And so he's one of them from Leaf Flash. We have some Adley Rushmans. A bunch of Julio Rodriguez's. Josh B, are you in the house, dude? Are you holding the AL East? I'm going to get uh, the boxes on the table. We're not going to open them, but I'll get those ready because we don't need to sit here and do nothing. All right, so again, we're taking the two boxes on this left side. Box one, box two. That leaves six fresh ones for another time. Contenders auto. Dude, that's sweet. I know. I feel like even those little things, Scott, right? Like, if you just want to buy up the right guy at the right time, like, I don't know if you want to keep it or I hold it until he comes up, which I probably would. That's why I haven't posted any of those Adleys or Bobby Witts or Rodriguez. Because I think once they come up, they're going to jump even more. And so buy something, some guy you believe in, and then just uh, wait and see what happens. But that's sweet, dude. 67 bucks now going for 90 plus of Witt Jr. It's kind of one thing I kind of like, too, is when a big prospect is on a sucky team. Because that should mean that they come up a lot faster, right? Auto ball and bad. Look at you, Scotty P, dude. You got some stuff, bro. I like that. I mean, like the newest ones, Frank, like Tops uh, 2022 just came out yesterday, this week. Um, so I think there's a whole new crop of rookies inside of there. But otherwise, like usually you wait for like the next year's Bowman stuff to come out. Nice, dude. Is it Gold Rush product or what were they doing? I know they do a lot of memorabilia stuff. All right, I'm going to get the packs ready because I'm not seeing any trades happening. I haven't seen Josh B in the house yet tonight either. Sometimes he's just watching and lurking. 
I was going to say, shouldn't these be somewhat sealed, but they are. I don't know, I gotta look, because uh, one of my buddy's little nephews is Jake Cousins for the Brewers, and he sent him a picture that he was, like, signing and stuff, and I don't know what product he signed in. Nice, dude, who is it? I mean, I've seen a lot of Cubs prospect stuff. I even hit one inside the shop here today, but... Well, let me know. I did have a dude, so we're going to close out uh, the trades, and we'll start opening them up. Um, I had a dude who's, I think it was like Hayden Younger from Elite Extra, and his dad was trying to buy up his autographs, and he offered one on me, and so I just like countered him for not that much more, and then he told me that he was his dad, and I was like, well, go ahead and like resend it, and I'll allow it, because I like when that happens. There's Henry Davis. There's Wander. Dude, well, that's not a bad pack right there, and Jordan Lawler. What's happening right now? Jonathan India made that kid's day. Michael Hermosillo. Dude, I don't know if I've seen him before. Dude, I feel like these are all the guys to get. None of these are refracted. But again, Davis is the central. Uh, Franco is the AL East. And then Jordan Lawler is the NL West for the D-backs. I like these little fire ones, except the only downside is they cut their name off. I feel like they could have, I don't know. I guess that's the whole point and the whole look of it, right? But I kind of think it's weird at the same time. Yeah, India's the refractor too, dude. For the AL Central. Or sorry, NL Central for Josh B. That was a really good pack. Dude, if I open that pack up in here, I would be really happy. I'll keep an eye out, Frank. I have not seen his stuff. Christian Hernandez, Austin Hendrick, Yelly, and... Oh, I've seen this guy all over the place. But his stuff's been moving. Alec Manoa. He is a Toronto Blue Jay for the AL East. Big hit Barker. Dude, that would have been dope. CT Bins, why aren't you designing cards? That's what I'm saying. Alec Manoa on Carter. Blue Jays, AL East, Josh B., Cody Bellinger. Dude always looks weird. He was an angel before that. I know I've done a lot of prospecty stuff, whether it's Leaf or like Pro Debut. I haven't seen him yet, Frank, but that doesn't mean he's not in there somewhere. There's Manoa, Spencer Howard. There's a Masterpieces. Tatis Jr. Someone tell me if that's crazy rare or not. I don't think it is, but it is an insert, and that's the NL West, and that is you, Trevor. Freeman, where's he going to go? What are they going to do with old Freddy? There's Dylan Carlson, NL Central. Matt Chapman, Atomic. AL West, Scott P. Matt Chapman, Atomic, and Bobby Dahlbeck, Refractor. I like the Atomics in here. Matt Chapman. All right, so we still need one more auto out of this mini. Or actually, sorry. We need a bunch more autos. Alec Bohm. There's Yelly Bomb to 250. He is an NL Central. Josh B. Iowa Cubs cards. Nice. And there is another NL Central. It is a refractor auto of Leover Piguero. Leover Piguero. And that is NL Central for the Pirates. Josh B. Again. So Josh B. Two for two. Ah, oh, Amy. She's falling, dude. Geraldo Perdomo. Falling to 20th. Altuve. Pete Alonzo, Dylan Carlson, rookie craftsmanship. Rookie craftsmanship, insert refractor. Jared Kalenic and a Lubob refractor. I feel like people might need to watch out for the Mariners. I feel like they were doing okay last year, and now they got 
Hopefully Kalenic turns into what he's supposed to be. He got off to a rough start. And then they got Julio coming up. It'll be interesting to see what happens. Well, there is a future of vibrance of Jason Dominguez and a Freddie Freeman right behind AL East. Jason Dominguez. Scott, what was the one we hit? We hit you a Wander, right? I think you sent me a picture on Twitter of it when it came in from a Leaf when we were doing those over Christmas. Again, Leafs really good about getting their stuff back in a super timely manner. Always appreciate that. There's Joe Adele. That's AL West. That's you, Scott. Nolan Arenado. Jackson Job. Ooh, an Andrew Vaughn rookie atomic. Not number, but I like that one for the AL Central. What was it number two, Scott? I don't remember. Was it like 50? 35 or 50? That's what our, we got our Dominguez back from that. And it came back as a 35er and sold in a day or two. That's pretty cool, dude. That's pretty rare right there, Trevor. And then a Shohei Refractor. Shohei Refractor. Dude, his, have you guys been watching 50? That's, I mean, that's solid, dude. Anything numbered from the big dudes are awesome. Otani's autograph. Have you been tracking that and seeing it in series one or a few other products? It does not look like it did from 27 or 2018 and beyond. I drafted this kid in our uh, first year player draft. Hopefully he pans out to be something. Taylor Trammell and NL West, Victor Acosta. For the Padres, NL West is Trevor. Deegan stays out in 13th. Never pit. That's the key to winning. Never pit. Run your car to the ground like Lightning McQueen. So be it if you explode. You gave it everything you had. And there's a Dylan Carlson a rookie refractor for the NL Central, which is Josh B. 41 out of 50. What are you going to do with this guy? Are you going to hold it or are you going to throw it up online? I can't remember what you said if you're a, not a flipper, but a, I call it refiner. Stuff that I don't need, I'll sell back and pick up stuff I do want. Casey Mize, there's the man, Bobby Witt Jr., Scherzer. And so that is uh, AL Central for the Royals. That is Trevor in the display case. Love it, dude. I like that. And those should have been on card, right? Was it not? I mean, the Dominguez stuff was. Most of the stuff that are on card there. Javi Baez in the Mets. Cattell Marte. There is Austin Martin. There's a Jordan Lawler refractor, so another good pack. Austin Martin, former top uh, Blue Jays dude, getting dealt. I felt like once he got traded, his stuff uh, plummeted. Like, his stuff was super hot, right? And then he got traded and it dropped. His stuff is su still crazy cheap. If you go look at, like, Leaf stuff, you could pick up Austin Martin. That or Pro Debut for pretty reasonable stuff. NL West, Trevor as well for the Jordan Lawler Refractor. Last pack from 101. <laughs> you don't even know what good card it is. Travis, what card is it? At least find out what card it is. There's Casey Mize, and here is, nice, dude, a Benny Montgomery. That is for the Rockies in the NL West. That penny sleeve isn't even worth a penny. It had a ding in it. But Benny does it, and that's an on Carter. It, it doesn't matter to sell it. <laughs> At least find out what it is. There's certain things that you should sell right away and other things you shouldn't. There's Ale East Adley Rushman. What's the card, T-Bins? At least tell us what that is. Before they make you sell off everything you own without even knowing anything about it. Because <laughs> there's certain stuff that you want to maybe just hold. Not keep forever. Like there's stuff that's in my like forever PC, right? But then there's other stuff that you want to just hold. Diamond Icon... I wouldn't, so I would say I wouldn't grade it. 
Uh, depends what it is, Frank, but soccer is hard to find, dude. If you find soccer retail, that might not be too bad. I don't see a lot of that. I don't actually see any of that out here outside of uh, NWSL for the Women's Soccer League. Five of five. So if it were me, T-Bins, I would wait till opening day and I would throw it up there and just let it roll. Agreed to do with LCS on a Wander 25, Bowman's best. Dang. Dude, so that's solid. So yours is significantly better. Should have done well on that. You should do pretty well on that, man. There's Joe Adele, Kyle Lewis. I like the little fire ones, but I agree. They could have done a something-something with it. I just don't like the name being cut off. Kids will never learn anything about them. 500 dollars cash in a box of Bowman. <laughs> Card is still pushing the sell. I feel like right now is not the time though. Until they're in season, I feel like there is a big difference. Ooh, we got a gold auto coming up at us. I feel like once it's in season. Ooh, there's Torque. And our auto is. Don't call me Carlos. It is Christian Santana. He just signed Santana. I love it. It's a bold move. On opening day, I would auction. I do a one-day auction and let it blow up. 28 out of 50. That is the AL Central. Trevor. Dude, I totally understand that. Does your, Scott, does your LCS buy stuff? Or, I mean, you could throw it up on Twitter and just tag a bunch of people and see what's going on. Yeah, Trevor's doing quite all right. There's the man. Kalenic. Kirilov, Ale Central, and Acuna, Refractor. Yeah, I, I mean, the stuff Golden's been taking has been like tens of thousands to hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of stuff, which is crazy. There's a Trout Atomic. That's never bad. Al West, Scott P. Mikey Trout Atomic. So to Shohei... Uh, Refractor and a Trout Atomic. Scott. And now we have the Yerminator for the AL Central and Trevor once again. Lots of eyes, no messages. I know Twitter is weird, dude. Every once in a while you'll get someone that just comes in and buys like a massive card like that. And then... Uh, only sells graded. I know, dude. I'm bad with the grading stuff. There's Joey Gallo. He is a Yankee here. And that is to 150 for the AL East. And then we have an NL East for Yiddy Cap. Yiddy Cap, Yiddy 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 Cap. NL East, William. We have not called you yet, buddy. But there you go. You're on the board with a Yiddy Cap. Yeah, yeah. Please do, dude. I'd like to see it. I don't know what the best method is. I never hit anything that expensive, so I don't have to worry about it. Geraldo Perdoma, Lubab, India. There's Heston. He should be back this year. Josh Donaldson. All right, two more autos to go. There's another Trouty, Chapman, Alec Bohm, Masterpiece. Jazz Chisel, NL Easter, and a Harry Ford. I'll have to put stuff in the Discord uh, chat, too. I don't know what I have that's cool, but we'll find out. There's a Jordan Lawler Atomic, dude. That's not bad, dude. NL West, Trevor. I mean, we had a normal one and now the Atomic one. I'm going to look up after this break to see what those are selling for. I mean, I'm sure when this first came out, they were crazy. There's a Soto Refractor NL East. But I feel like that one's probably good. We got a blue auto. There's Jazz Chisholm. Double Jazz if you're nasty. Refractor's at the back. Alec Manoa. And we have a Geraldo Perdomo. 
and that is the NL West. Trevor! Crushing it. And then Jazz, Rookie Refractor. Yeah, I haven't messed with whatnot too much. I think Carter loves it, don't you, buddy? Chase Petty, Blaze, Acuna, Joey Bart, Future. All right, two more packs for this dual divvy. Yerminator, Miggy, Donaldson. There's a Judge and a Chase Petty. Bowman's best, Aaron. Hit a nice little auto of him in our Diamond Kings Dynasty break last, if you didn't see it. I know, t -Bit, it's crazy, dude. So, uh, what was it? It was a Wander foil. Or no, no, it was the Wander from the Silver Packs. Um, one of the dudes, he's from Chicago, he posted up that the first day they were selling for like 150, or no, sorry, like 120, 115, and now two days later, they're selling for $53. It is crazy how much the market dips. It is also weird on how much it dips even on like a big dude like that. There's the AL East, that's Josh B for Gunnar Hoagland. And then Blaze Jordan. All right, there you guys go.